Yes guys, welcome back to Hair System DIY. Today we're gonna to be doing a really quick grooming tutorial which can get you up, out of bed, and out the door looking as fresh as a daisy. Last night I did not wear a do-rag on purpose so that my hair could look a mess and I could groom it really quickly. So what do I do when I need to get out somewhere really important and I need to look smart? Well, a couple of things. Number one, get yourself a paddle brush. Number two, get yourself some leave-in conditioner. And number three, if you so want it, a nice bit of styling gel. So how do I usually begin this grooming process? So the first thing I do when I get up, I look in the mirror and see what needs fixing. So I've got a mirror here. This is the one that I usually use, the classic barber one. I highly recommend you get one yourself. So I always begin by just brushing it down, which is quite easy. Sometimes it can get a bit tangled. What I would say, if it's really tangled, don't force it. So with this particular paddle brush, it has quite soft actual bristles on it. It's not really firm. I find you get a problem with the firm ones because it can pull too hard, it can tear the base, that's the last thing you want. If it's pulling really hard, what I would say, have a quick shower, put some shampoo in, it should loosen up the tangles. I did a video a couple of weeks ago showing you how to shampoo a hair system. If you stick around to the end of the video, that will come up on the screen. So just make sure you keep brushing it. And as I said, if there's tangles, have yourself a nice shower and put some shampoo in there. So make sure you brush the back as well because the, quite often, if you've been sleeping without a do-rag, then the back can get a bit sort of stuck up and tufty. I'll give you an example, actually. Sort of looks like that. <laughs> it looks like that. Okay, so you wanna make sure that you also prioritize pushing the back down. And then what you have, it's flat, but it looks quite lifeless. So we wanna make sure, if I can find it, that we have some leave-in conditioner. All of the products that I use are in my description box, so make sure you check that out at the end of this video. And you wanna just spray all around where the hair system is. You can also spray your natural hair if you want on the sides, but I usually just focus on the hair system. Why do we use leave-in conditioner? We use leave-in conditioner because this isn't hair that's growing out of your head, so it lacks the necessary oils to give it the nutrition that it needs to stay looking healthy and nutrient dense. So leave-in conditioner is really important. And then from there, you can kind of start styling it as you like. Now, every couple of days, I thought I'd mention this because it's also quite important, it's part of my routine, pure argan oil. Now I only do this, as I said, once every two to three days. And it can be a bit of a bugger to get out, here we go, and I just, sort of allow a few drops sort of on the system, not too much, you don't want to overdo it. All over the system, like so. So do not apply this liberally because if you do apply it liberally, it just makes the system look a little bit greasy. Again, just go through that with your paddle brush and then you can start styling. So I always recommend pushing it straight down to begin with and pushing it straight back at the back, okay? That avoids the risk of having any tangles in the hair. Now lastly, this is a styling product which I've been using for quite some time, Creative Texture. I also use one which is, it's like a powder, it's called a hair powder, uh, which is also quite good, but it's quite hard to get out, whereas this is a bit more subtle, so I don't use too much. And the great thing about this is it doesn't pull too hard on the hair. So push that into the hair system. I wouldn't re recommend wax or anything like that. This doesn't tend to pull on the hair, so you don't have loads of hair coming out of the hair system. That's the last thing that you want. And then you can just start styling it. So let's see how we're doing. And then what I quite like to do is just sort of mess it up a little bit, not too much. You don't wanna be creating loads of tangles, but you know, I do quite like the messy look for people who've been following me on my channel for a long time. You'll do know I sometimes go for the hair down, messy look, just quite like it with a poly, this is an ultra thin skin. 
This is a Levivid see-through ultra thin skin system. If you're interested in getting the system yourself, you can get a 15% discount, Adam15, in their coupon code box, levividhair.com. All of that information, again, is in the description box. If you want this system or plenty of other systems that they do offer, I've been wearing their systems for over two years now and I've always been super impressed. They certainly get my seal of approval. So there you go, guys how to groom your hair system in under five minutes. Great for if you're in a rush somewhere, it doesn't need to take much time at all. Now, for those of you who watched the video until the end, I mentioned a bit earlier that there is a shampooing technique you can use if your hair system is really tangled up. So that's popping up on the screen right now, how to shampoo a hair system. I hope you found this tutorial really helpful, guys. I hope you decide to use this in your daily routine and I'll speak with you very soon. Bye for now.